This is harmony between the East and the West. At the MH China concert, musicians from the London Philharmonic Orchestra and some top Chinese soloists have gathered in central London's Cadogan Hall. The works in the show incorporate traditional Chinese sounds scored for a Western symphony orchestra and a Western solo instrument, aiming to bring the audience unique sonic experiences. Before the show, hours of rehearsals are needed to create the music cocktail. These musical notes help bridge language and cultural gaps between Chinese and Western musicians. Yet, this is no easy work. Yang Shufei, one of China's most renowned classical guitarists, says retaining Chinese characteristics while playing on Western instruments is the key. Western instruments can offer harmony, polyphony, but Chinese instruments are usually very lyrical, but they can do, they, they, they basically very melodic, very lyrical, very free, uh, but they can create hundreds of ways of playing one single note. When playing Chinese music on the Western instruments, you have to retain the essence of the Chinese music, but offer something more on your, on your instruments. For Chinese classical music fans, London Philharmonic Orchestra is a familiar name. Since the 1970s, it has had regular exchanges with Chinese musicians. Well, we've been, we've been many, many times to many, many cities, and we've always had a very positive response when we've been there. Obviously, we played uh, a very Western program, you know, but we did some Chinese pieces as encores, and as soon as we started playing those, the audience erupted because obviously they were very familiar. The Chinese embassy said there would be more such joint performances in the future as China gradually reopens its borders. Uh, we are looking forward to having more Chinese people, to having more Chinese artists uh, and tourists uh, come to visit the UK. And we also welcome more and more uh, Londoners, uh, British people to visit China. We will have more uh, cooperation culturally and in the other fields. Back in the 19th century, Chinese orchestras would play European music, and many of those orchestras were partly staffed by European musicians. But now, as music education in China grows, the tables have turned. Eminent Chinese composers have a growing presence in the British concert halls, where they step out of the shadows and into the spotlight.